tech rabbit here. Picks up one of these, and um, you know everybody's seen a leaf blower before, but um, you know they just tend to blow the leaves from one place to the other, and then when a big storm comes, then they blow them back if you haven't, uh, if you don't pick them up. So this actually has a vacuum cleaner function for sucking up the leaves, also. So um, I thought we could do an unboxing and then um, give it a quick test. Maybe not the most exciting product, but it will be very useful if it does work. Oh, that's quite a big bag. This is uh, a chain of stores that's very Scandinavian, so if you don't live in Europe, Scandinavia, then you're probably likely not to get it with that brand, but I'm 100% sure <laughs> this exists. <laughs> exactly the same device, just with different brands on So, well, let's see, that's the main unit. And, uh, let's see how it, how it should be put together. such small text. Small text and small pictures. <laughs> Fasten it with screws, so one has to basically, yeah, I suppose one has to guess what screws to use. So presumably the ones that um, make sense for that specific location. Okay, I think I figured it out. There's five. Actually, there more? One, two, three, four. There's six of these sized screws. So I'm thinking that there's probably two of these go. Go in one on each side.
screw it in. And I'm going to try and understand the next step. <laughs> Look there. That's that's interesting. So what's that doing? Oh no. I should have taken Look, you see, they packed that one and that one needs to go on, so I need to actually unscrew it again. Oh I thought they pack it that way. So So let's start. Looks like I'm gonna have to get a long Okay, found this. Oh, I need that, that, that long sc screwdriver to be able to reach in here and connect this on. So that's, that's done. And now it's for the wheels. Well, there's two of them. Okay, let's 
ですね Will be the bag, Pull the vacuum. Two parts to, to fill, and I'm assuming this one. There. Uh, yes, that clips on there, and then they have an emptying option by opening it up, emptying out the content. So that's good. And then the next. Well, the only thing I'm wondering is where are these supposed to be used? So I will come back when I figure out where those are supposed to go. Okay. So basically the instructions don't really tell you to install these, but in the picture they are here for to support this nozzle. So theoretically one should be able to put actually the picture doesn't really th this picture I have in, in this manual does not um, it's not particularly representative of this specific solution. Let's just double check. Well it is there but it's Yeah, it's it's kind of missed the missed to um, missed to have these. So, but, you know, since one has dealt with bad instructions before, we actually can get those issues resolved. Picture. But anyway, uh, theoretically speaking, this is not really sure how one should use the strap. Just probably around the neck or something. But now it's um, it's complete, and we should go do some um, testing. Anyway, I'm going to try and test the blower and vacuum cleaner. I have to keep the camera quite far away from the 
in the work area, do the dust. And we'll see how this works.
Yeah, I think I'll do the job. I just think I need to get rid of the camera, poor thing. <laughs> it's getting a bit dusty. No, but that's a that's a good combination. Blowing to get the leaves from out from where you can't get them, and then vacuum them up when they're accessible. Um, right now, we don't have a huge number of leaves out here, but in the in the fall, we do get a, the storms blow in lots of leaves. Yeah, so yeah, I think the, it'll get dirty real quick. Anyway, if you found this interesting, um, consider subscribing, hit the like button, thought it was worth it. Um, merch is available, um, or if you'd just like to buy me a cup of coffee, that's also possible, the links are in the description. Um, all the proceeds will go to supporting the channel, and getting more equipment to test for the channel, and uh, I'll see you in the next one.